China's foreign minister is warning of a spillover of violence from Myanmar to other parts of the region. Chin Gang is stressing the importance of maintaining clear and stable borders and calling for a crackdown on cross-border crime. Now, the foreign minister spoke on a rare visit to Naypyidaw. Mr Chin met yesterday with military chief Min Ong Lai. The talks come amid mounting international criticism as fighting intensifies between the army and pro-democracy forces. Efforts by Myanmar's Southeast Asian neighbors to end the violence since the February 2021 coup have failed to make any headway. The foreign minister says that China supports Myanmar finding its own path. He's urging the international community to respect the country's sovereignty and to focus on helping Myanmar achieve peace and reconciliation. Let's speak to Leon Waikit for more on this story. Good evening, Waikit. Myanmar's army, the Tatmadaw, has been shunned by many countries. Is this a sign at all that China is throwing its full weight, its support, behind the military government? Well, Don, this is precisely the narrative that the Myanmar army is going with. In fact, in a Myanmar language statement, uh, Myanmar army said that Chin Kang's visit to Nepido shows that Beijing is standing with Myanmar on the international stage. So, of course, they would choose to play up this aspect of the trip. But from the Chinese ministry's uh, point of view, it's positioning Chin Kang's visit to Myanmar as a follow-up trip to President Xi Jinping's uh, visit to Myanmar back in 2020. That was when President Xi met State Council Aung San Suu Kyi, and that was when both China and Myanmar signed some 30 over deals back then. Now, of course, this trip can largely be seen as China's uh, advancing its own interests during this trip, because as we know, Tim Gang had made a visit to the border areas where he had expressed hope for the Chinese uh, Belt Road Initiative projects to be revived. Now, for that to happen, Chinese, uh, the, the chi uh, China rather, would need the support of the Myanmar military because they need peace and security at the border areas, and they also need the Myanmar army's help to protect Chinese infrastructure and and buildings. Given that in the past there had been attacks by the local resistance forces against Chinese assets uh, over perceived uh, support from the China to the Myanmar military. Waikit, Chin Gang has urged the international community to respect Myanmar's sovereignty and to be part of this process towards peace. How exactly does China f imagine that the international community can play that part? Well, it has its official position, and, and then again, it also has its unofficial behind-the-scenes position. Let's start with that. Um, unofficially, it has been brokering peace deals uh, in, 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 in Myanmar. It has been uh, sending high-level senior officials to engage with the Myanmar army. It has been promoting peace talks among the ethnic armed groups uh, along the border areas. And very early on, my sources have also told me that China had started talking to the Civilian National Unity Government, or the NUG. In fact, I just stepped out of an online uh, media conference by the NUG where it said that it maintains very close ties and, 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 and channels with its neighbors, including China. So behind the scenes, China has been actively uh, involved in trying to promote peace in Myanmar. But its official position is that um, it, it, it says there are no quick fixes to the resolution uh, to, to, to the crisis in Myanmar, and it throws its support behind ASEAN to mediate uh, a resolution uh, in Myanmar. But therein lies the problem because ASEAN does not have an official uh, conflict resolution mechanism, which basically means ASEAN's hands are tied which is why all eyes will be on the ASEAN summit uh, later this week in Indonesia to see whether ASEAN leaders can come up with any creative solutions for Myanmar. Waikit, thank you for that. You're on Waikit there.